everybody, welcome to Texas Z Chat. I'm Serge. I'm Rob. I'm Gen Z. I'm Gen X. And welcome to our next episode of Will You Press the Button? So this is a fun series. If you haven't checked out our previous videos, make sure you do so. We have a playlist link in the description below to all of our uh, Will You Press the Button videos. Basically, how Will You Press the Button works, if you're not familiar already, is you'll be given a good prompt and a bad prompt. So something good will happen to you and something bad will happen to you. If you press the button, you have the good thing and bad thing happen to you. If you don't press the button, neither of them will happen to you. So it's a fun little game of choices and you get to decide um, what option you would choose. And as we go through these videos, um, if you feel free to, um, you go ahead and just write down what you would choose in the comments below. We're curious to see what options would you choose. Do you agree with our choices? Do you disagree with our choices? It's basically, it's just like a fun family game for yeah. everyone to take part in. It's and a good time. So we hope you guys enjoy. Have fun with it. And um, yeah, let us know what you think in the comments. All right. Into the video. You don't have to pay for anything for the rest of your life, but you can never hear music again. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah. And it says pay for anything. Anything. Okay, I know what I would do. What would you do? I would press that button. Oh, really? I love music, <laughs> but there are so many things I can experience without listening to music. Mm. That would give me great joy as well. I see. Yeah, for me, um, as a gamer, a lot of, almost every video game you'll see that comes out nowadays is, uses music in it. Um, because it's, it complements the form. It, it, it's like complements the multimedia. So it really does. As someone who yeah. consumes a lot of it, uh, I wouldn't, would not press the button because you'd want to keep that sensation that music gives you. Right. Right. Or but also I want to play games and stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I, I would, I would not press the button. You would press the button, right? Yeah. Okay. So I'll press it for you, but I, I would not in this case. This is our first, uh, time disagreement. Agree. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, different generation. Well, Civil War is starting. <laughs> you guys are watching it. <laughs> How dare you take music away? I know. Come on. <laughs> come on, man. All right. So uh, 43%, 57%. So <laughs> most people agree with me. Okay. So yeah. on to the next one. You can bring anything from your imagination into the real world whenever you want. You can bend reality, but mm. you are alone. Your power doesn't work outside your room slash house and you can't leave it ah, okay hmm. this one's easy for me oh wait no it's, oh wait a minute wait a minute <laughs> i just read you are alone <laughs> I, I forgot that one part of this phrase well you, you go ahead given the wallflower that i am mm -hmm. uh the shy timid creature that i am um the inability to socialize and be friends with other people like i am um not i would <laughs> not push that button yeah I, I probably wouldn't press it either i wouldn't want to be alone yeah i, 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 I be trapped I, in my house because I, yeah i don't want to be completely restricted from going anywhere not only that but i go crazy I, I and then i'll feel depressed if i don't leave the house if i'm stuck in the house for 48 hours <laughs> yeah. i just i gotta go for a walk i gotta go for a drive i gotta go to the store or something i just can't yeah that, be home for me i, I am a <laughs> i am a I can be a caveman sometimes. So I, I can I can be in my man cave and just stay there and definitely just play video games and whatnot. Um, but if you're restricted by this, let's say your house slash your room catches on fire, mm. you can't leave it and all of a sudden you're dead. Right. Yeah. So uh, I'm not pressing that button. Yeah. So. Oh, look at that. I th wow, most people hmm. press the button. I guess the idea is you can bring anything into your room, but... How big is your room? Can you make your room bigger? <laughs> How big can you make it? There's lots of qualifiers that I would want to throw at this. You can create a whole other world, I suppose, in your room. And right. So your room really is no longer your your room entrapment. Yeah. 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 But I don't know. <laughs> it, 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 I feel like we need more specifics. <laughs> so. Immortality, but you're poor and everyone you, you've meet and everyone you meet forgets you. So immortality. But you are poor, and everyone you meet forgets you. I would uh, not not press, press the button. That button. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think I think we've gone over some other questions to this. So yeah. no, we would not press the button, and most oh. would not. Yeah, yeah, that's a that's a higher percentage. Mm -hmm. Next question: Your favorite sports teams always make it to their respective championship game or series in dramatic fashion, but. Your favorite sports teams always lose a championship <laughs> in a painful manner. <laughs> um, um, <laughs> okay, I know what I would do. Uh, I know what I would do as well. What would you do? I would 
press that button because it'd be right. a lot of fun and a lot of thrill to oh. watch my teams, uh, you know, get to that point. And mm. um, confession time, I probably place a few bets in Vegas uh, at the same time. <laughs> so, mm. uh, hey, you know, you got to do what you got to do. So. Yeah. Um, for me, I don't really watch sports, so <laughs> I don't really care about this question. So we'll leave it in your hands. What about the placing bets in Vegas? I'll let you do the bets. <laughs> <laughs> right. For for me, I, I I don't I don't have a favorite sports team because I'm not into sports. So um, I'm into working out, but not sports. So ready? All right. Let's let's press the button. Take it on. The next most one. people oh, let's see. most people disagree with you. You're, wow. Well, you, you're basically <laughs> you. I guess the way is it's a question is that the way you laid it out is that you're super passionate, you're super into your team, but your team is always going to lose in yeah. a really painful manner. Yeah. Not just lose, but lose in a painful manner, which yeah. is why most people did not want to press that button because they want their team to have a chance of winning. They're loyal. Yeah. I get it. Yeah. yeah. But uh, yeah. for me, either way, because, yeah, not my thing. <laughs> no matter to you, right? Yeah. yeah. Next one. A truly immersive VR version of your fairy game exists and you get to play it but you are trapped inside it until it is beaten and will die in real life if you lose. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Uh, no, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Why gamble that, right? Yeah, Rob, this is, this is a perfect question for you. You just played Halo. Would you uh, be able to? Uh, you know, I like the Master Chief. Uh, this guy, he's, he's pretty serious. Uh, but no, I would not press that button which you're lucky you would step on your own grenade <laughs> <laughs> no, not that that's happened right yeah I, you've you've had <laughs> you've had happened. probably a, a few, well well over 100 deaths in the first halo game well i think everyone has driven over the cliff once in a while in their yeah in their so play. this is this is like a death sentence so no no thank you um yeah we, we're, we're not doing it <laughs> take that one out let's see oh it's split Look wow at why is it so evenly split a lot of people are uh, surprised they're those <laughs> Yeah, they're probably good gamers. Right? Yeah, but if it's a VR version of your fair game, and you're not used to playing VR, it's a whole new. Even though it's your fair yeah. game, it's a whole new experience, which means you're go, going into it with no experience. Yeah. So you're very likely to die. Um, free foods, free food and drinks anytime you want, but wear a bearded knit cap for the rest of your life. Hmm. Okay, I know what I would do. Bearded knit cap. What's a bearded knit cap? Uh, just uh, probably something that was darned together. Um, a big um, um, wool cap or something. But bearded doesn't mean it comes with like a fake beard or something? Wear a bearded <laughs> knit cap. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we need to look this one up, guys. All right, let's look it up. We're looking what up. Is a, what is a bearded knit cap? Oh, look at that. Oh, okay. So yeah. it, it comes with a beard. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So now we know what a bearded knit cap is. How many of you guys knew what a bearded knit cap is? You, it's got that lumberjack look. Yeah, but it's not. It's, oh, look it, doesn't at this look, one. it doesn't look really real, though. This one's yeah. crazy. Okay. You have to wear it for the rest of your life. No, I'm good. I'm good. Not interested. <laughs> no, no, thank you. No. <laughs> no, thank you. Wow. It's That's pretty evenly even. split. Really evenly split. Huh. Well, and and people who know me know I love food, but uh, my gosh, not not enough to always have a bearded knit cap on. Yeah, and it's gonna be hot outside a mm -hmm. lot of times. I don't want that. Yeah, no, thank you. <laughs> Imagine showing up in your job interview with one of those. <laughs> That's yeah. right. Yeah, you're fired. <laughs> yeah. you're, I but, I but I didn't even get hired yet. You're still fired. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You go home all the time. I don't know why I can't get a job here. You know. Yeah, you're, you're, you're ranting to your friend while wearing that thing on your face. Yeah. Imagine trying to start to uh, date someone wearing one of those. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you might have to be concerned, like, who'd want to date me if I always have to wear it? <laughs> right. All right, guys, we're cutting the episode here. Um, we hope you guys enjoy this video. It's a lot of fun for us to do these. Um, we hope we're interested to hear what you chose for these options. Um, let us know in the comments below which ones did you pick. Um, and if you had fun, um, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell icon so you can stay tuned for future videos. Um, we will have a playlist down in the description below where you can see all of our will you press the button videos. Um, 
as and we'll be covering some more fun games in the future so if there's any ones that you can think of that you think will be fun for us to try out um kind of like fun little family games like this one right here that we're trying out um let us know because we like to have fun uh, and the nice thing about these types of games is they they, <laughs> they encourage discussion yeah. and have a lot of humor and fun to them and also some interesting thought-provoking ones as well yep and you kind of like Serge and I get to know each other a little bit more too so yeah good times so we get to know each other better and you guys get to know us better so it's a fun little interaction so with that being said we hope you enjoyed this video make sure you stay tuned for the next one we'll see you soon all right guys take care yeah.